Hello everyone, welcome to Creatively Crafty Me. I am Charlena and today we are going to do a couple of Halloween advents. So I have two here. I have one with uh, some hand dyed yarn and another with some stitch markers and every day I'm just going to open up one of the packages so this time there is a act there is actually a total of 13 packages so we're going to do oh it's a whole lot of goodies in here too oh look at that so this is actually the first time obviously that I'm opening up this package and it came with all these goodies in it so this is fun so we have a pencil and this particular hand dyed yarn came from Dragonflight Yarn and there is all her information. She is a hand dyer on Etsy and we received some Halloween stickers. Plenty of Halloween stickers and I'm sure under here is just my packing slip. So some quick information. Oh and look we also have a little notebook so some quick information about this particular um, okay uh, some quick information about this like I said it came from Dragonflight Yarns on Etsy and it is a total of 13 skeins so this one here the largest one is for day 31 and we start with okay like I said this is a 13 day Halloween advent so we have 13 packages and you're supposed to start on the 19th of October and open the final package on the 31st of October okay and in addition to doing the 13 day hand dyed yarn I wanted to do a 13 day um, I wanted to do a 13 day stitch marker so this is a Halloween stitch marker advent calendar lobster class closures this came from Daisy May Knit Co this came from Daisy May Knit Co on Etsy and they are just 13 individual bags and each bag has a stitch marker in it and each one of these little bags is also stamped with a little Halloween um, image. So this is bag one and it has a little um, witch on it. This bag 12 has a little um, jack-o'-lantern. Bag five says happy Halloween. And I thought it would just be really cute and really fun to open up one mystery yarn, one mystery hand dyed yarn as well as one mystery stitch marker so I'm not really sure I haven't decided last year I last year I also did an advent for Halloween and I knew at the end of everything I wanted to make some socks this time I'm not really sure what I'm going to do with the yarn but I will be sure to make something with it so let's just get started we're just going to start with day one for the stitch marker and technically package 19 for the hand dyed yarn. So let's start with the stitch marker first. Okay, here we go. Oh, that's so cute. Okay, so our stitch marker for the first day is this blue skeleton. Hopefully you can see that. Yeah, that's cute so we have this blue skeleton head and for our first package so our first package let's see what we're going to get there is something extra in here because I can um, actually feel like a card oh look at that that is so pretty 
Oh, we got some goodies. So it says the colorway of this one is called Pumpkin Patch. The weight is fingering and there are 87 yards and 20 grams. And this is our first skein of hand dyed yarn. This orange color in the colorway Pumpkin Patch. And then we also have a little goodie here. Let's see what's in this little package. Aww. Oh, look at that claw on that. That's huge. So that's cute. We have a little, we have a little um, necklace with a lobster claw on it, which is cute for anyone who knits and crochets. That's super cute. And then we also have a stitch marker, a pumpkin stitch marker. So this is what we received for day one. We actually have a few stitch markers this time and this yarn. So that is day one, guys. Come back tomorrow to see what day two looks like. And continue to come back to see what I make with these yarns. Okay, guys. That's it for now. Thank you so much for joining me. And I will talk to y'all in the next video. Okay. Bye. That's cute.